Hey guys, and ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> My fucking toe! Oh. Hey guys, and welcome back. Hey! I wasn't in yet. It's already. I stubbed my toe. Welcome back to my channel. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we will be doing something. I'm reorganizing my bookshelf. Reorganizing my bookshelf. Yeah, well you heard it first from Fletcher. Today we're gonna to be reorganizing my bookshelf. Um I really don't like the way it looks. These two shelves here that you can see are actually like clean and nice because I keep them that way because they're the background of my videos, but what you can't see is the the top the top two and the, the bottom two are kind of a mess uh, because I don't have enough room for all my books and I have another bookshelf that way, like just a little mini one, so we're going to organise that too. So I thought I'd take all my books off and put them all back on and we're going to make it look cute. Hopefully I'm going to try and like make it look aesthetic and if I don't like that then I'll just put it back the way it was. Um, but yeah, we're going to try and make it look cute. So before we get into the video, I just want to quickly thank the sponsor of today's video, which is Madame Glam. They were kind enough to gift me this little set. Now, Madame Glam is a nail company. They sell gel nail polishes, and they were kind enough to send me, let me pick out a couple of colours and try them out for you guys. And I tried them out a couple of weeks ago, and I really, really liked them. I'll put in the clips of me trying on the nail polishes but they're really smooth really nice and they last quite a long time as well i had those nails on for about like two weeks i think before i got my nails redone because i get like acrylics um but yeah i really like the nail polishes and this is what they sent me so it comes with a little mini light which is just the curing lamp obviously for the gel nail polish it's just like a mini one which is awesome because it's so much like smaller than some of the other like curing lights that you can get and this one just has like a usb plug-in and awesome and then obviously comes with like the instructions of what to do, how to apply like the gel nail polish and stuff like that if you've never done it before, which is awesome. And then, of course, a top coat and a base coat and their no wipe, which is awesome because then they don't get really sticky on your nails. And then the three colours that I picked out are these three here. So the first one was this really pretty green called Lost in the Woods. It's just kind of like an emerald green colour. You'll probably see better in the clip that I'll... Um, I'll put on the screen I guess um, when I'm editing but it's a really really pretty green color and then I picked out a nice pink because I love a pink nail polish and then turn it on. anyway the pink it's kind of like a muted pink color which is super super pretty and then I got a blue because I don't own any blue nail polish like this and so I wanted to pick out a blue and this one's kind of like a like a cobalt blue and it's called take me to Mykonos and it's just like a really pretty blue color and yeah i'm obsessed with these nail polishes they're super super nice and they were actually kind enough to give me a discount code for you guys to get you 30 percent off so if you want 30 percent off you can use my discount code on the screen i believe it's chantel 30 underscore one maybe and if you click the link link in the description box it'll take you straight to the website and apply the discount at the checkout so yeah once again thank you to Madame Glam for sponsoring this video and you guys should definitely check them out if you have been wanting to do your own nails at home so let's just go ahead and get into the reorganizing of my bookshelf because I feel like it's gonna be a long process all right so this is the before of what we're working with as you can see there's just kind of books everywhere um and like these two shelves like I said pretty good and then this one, and then this one's just kind of messy as well. And then I have this over here as well, which is like a little mini bookshelf, um, which is kind of a mess, to be honest. Um, and then that's like my outfits for my Harry Styles concert in there. I don't know why they're in there. I just shop them in there. Um, but yeah, so we're gonna fix all of this and just want to show you the before really quick. So you're gonna have to ignore the mess that is my desk. That if my desk is kind of messy, I apologize. Um, but I'm gonna start by taking everything off my bookshelf and then we'll kind of go from there. So I'm gonna time lapse it so I can listen to some music uh, while I do it, uh, but yeah. The 
this is completely irrelevant to the video, but I just got a package and I have to show you guys, if you guys watch, you guys definitely do watch uh, Steph Bohr on YouTube. Everyone knows her, everyone loves her. She's one of my favorite booktubers ever. And she just came out with, I don't wanna call it merch cause it's not really merch, but you know, it's like, it's like our merch, like as she says. And I bought the phone case and the t-shirt, but apparently they've been shipped separately, which is fine. But the phone case just came and I'm obsessed. So if you haven't seen, it says Hopeless Romantic on it and it's got like a little moon and I just got it in the mail so I thought I'd unbox it with you guys. I'm obsessed. So it just says Hopeless Romantic on it. And if you guys don't know, obviously I'm a hopeless romantic. I love romance. I love love and it's just great. And so I'm really excited to have this phone case and I've had, I love my Harry phone case. I've had this one on for ages, but I think it's time to like switch it up. I love Harry obviously, but I love this phone case, so I'm very excited to put it on. I love it. Oh my god. Look, ah, it's so nice. I'm obsessed. I haven't even started doing it yet, but like I I mean that you know when you get like a burst of motivation, you just really want to do something and then like you start doing it and then you don't want to do it. Yeah, that's my mood right now, and now I just am regretting my decision. And I don't wanna <laughs> I don't wanna do this anymore. <laughs> but it's fine, it's fine. We're gonna we're gonna push through. This is what we're working with, by the way. Look. I have so many piles. I don't even know. I don't even know where to start, to be honest. Ugh. Lightning stricken cactus, and it starts to rain. Okay, so this is the shelf, uh, the only shelf I've done. No, I just have, I mean, I have that little bit up there. But this is what I've done so far. I've just kind of got, these books are all the same size, so I like to keep them together. Um, and then I've just put like my Off Campus and Bray U series long ways, just cause I don't know, fits that way. And then this is more Al Kennedy, so I wanted to keep that next to there and then these books are all the same size because I have a thing I just need all my books to be the same size even though this doesn't technically match up but I think I like how this looks so far nature's brew of all kinds of things the mountain sunk hill sky color schemes makes you forget about all types of things you remind me of the Arizona thunder Satisfy the times and make you wonder about the bigger picture in your life. The simple times in the Arizona thunder, the Arizona thunder tonight. just I don't want to do this anymore <laughs> I regret all my decisions like I've gone what five shelves I've got one left but one of them I'm not really happy with so I might end up changing it we'll see um but I just finished the shelf I'll show you like close up after but I'm gonna do the top shelf now let's go last one and I still have so many books
Okay, so I think I think we're officially done. It's only taken me like four hours. Uh, but yeah, I don't even know if I'm entirely happy with it, but like I don't really have anywhere else or any other way that I can do this. So I'm just gonna show you. The top shelf, I basically just moved like my Colleen Hoover up here and then we have my little Harry's house thing. There, this shelf is pretty similar to how it was before, except I've added a few new books in there. Um, this shelf is pretty much exactly the same because I just, I like it this way. Um, and then I've got like my Draco candle and my little Santa for Christmas time. That'll obviously be gone um, when Christmas time's over. But yeah, I just, I added pretty much this book in there, which I picked up the other day. Um, and other than that, that's the same. This one's completely different. I've kind of got all the ones that are like the same height and then my little Christmas plushy thing and then my crystals. Um, and yeah, I just wanted to switch out the, you know, the background of my videos a little bit. And then this shelf, I had it in a different way where I had my off campus in the middle, as you would have seen earlier in the video, but I had to put it this way because it fits more books this way, even though I kind of like it better the other way, but <laughs> I can't really do anything. And then I just have a little candle and a little bear there. And then this shelf is quite different as well. I've kind of got my after series over there and then like just a bunch of books that are the same height. I've got all my uh, like non romance books here um, and then it goes into romance um, over here. But yeah, I've got all my non romance books together. And then coming over here, this is just my little other bookshelf in my room. That's just like this little small thing. Um, I have all like my Harry Styles One Direction books here. This one's new at Big W if you guys want to go get it. I got mine from Target, um, but they have it at Target and Big W and it's brand new and I kind of showed it a little bit earlier, you would have seen. Um, but I'm obsessed. If you love Harry Styles, definitely go pick it up. $19, Big W or Target. It's probably going to sell out really quickly, but I'm obsessed with it. And then, yeah, I just have all my other Harry books and then some One Direction ones as well um, on there. And then my One Direction DVDs up there. And that will probably, again, change once I get more books. And then this is my little Harry Potter corner. I just have my painting of me and Draco. Um, and then, you know, some wands and all my Harry Potter books. And then, like, a little Ushi and a little crane thing there. And then down here... I have books that kind of don't fit anywhere else. Got like a book that kind of doesn't fit anywhere else and then we've just got all of these books here and then a little One Direction like money box thing that I, I just, I've had it like for years and it's just still in there. And then this one, I moved all like my Harry stuff for the concert and put books here that didn't really fit and they're kind of all miscellaneous sizes. And yeah, so I just have my like special editions of the after and then the Kiss Quotient series and the Stay With Me series and yeah. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you give it a thumbs up if you do. Subscribe to my channel if you're not already and hopefully my bookshelf ends up looking really good. I'm filming this outro before I finish the video so yeah, but I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye guys!